Hey everyone, I'm having a really fantastic day. I am here with a beauty carousel video, which will hopefully be the first in a series. Let me guys know in the comments down below if you like this idea. But I figured I would do kind of a weekly what's in my makeup bag, what I'm currently using on an everyday basis. Um, so you guys can see what I'm like truly using because some things I don't talk about um, a lot on this channel, especially like a new products, so you can see if I'm using them a lot or not. So yeah, um, we'll try it out and see how it goes over. But this is the smaller version of my everyday makeup bag. Um, I have another one that I just keep hanging on my doorstep. It's actually one of the ones I showed you guys I got for Christmas. Um, so check out the what I got for Christmas video and you'll see the other one that I'm talking about. But this one here is really great and compact. It's nice and small. I actually mentioned this in my last video which was my favorites. Um, so I won't talk too much about it. But let's just go ahead and jump right in. I'm just going to start within this front zipper pocket here which I really love super handy and here I just have my NARS eyeshadow base and actually there's in the color uh, but yes this is a clear version of that love that holy grail everyday makeup item you guys know I love it I also have my covergirl clump crusher extensions mascara which I have not been too crazy about I was kind of disappointed by it by it um, but I'm still going to go ahead and use it up because I don't like, you know, just wasted money. So I have that here as well as my L'Oreal Voluminous Million Lashes Excess, which I still am really liking in combination with my Wet n Wild Mascara. This is the Megalink. This is my current favorite of everything I have right now. really, really like this. Really great at like lengthening and all that good stuff. And it's very black. Also has some Q-tips in here. And then getting into these pockets here. First off, I have my eyelash curler, which I believe is from ELF. Um, <laughs> as I drop it. Yeah, it's just super basic. Good eyelash curl. And then I have my MAC palette in, which looks like this. Um, but I just have my two eyeshadows, soft brown which is right here, and then Woodwings, which is right here. I'm wearing soft brown today, but yeah, these are just <clears throat> two neutrals that I've recently added to my collection and that I've been liking. And then I have Max Satin Taupe, which is a really, really great, like gray, grayish kind of taupe, basically. Um, it has a satin finish, obviously, which is really great. So um, I go on and off with this, but I'm currently working this back into my routine. And then I have, of course, another Holy Grail product. My Mac Eyeshadow and Saddle, which the cap is broken off, but just an amazing everyday color that I'm wearing today as well. And then I have my Benefit Watts Up Highlighter, which I still really, really love. Um, I actually have two of these, and... I opened up the other one um, because I couldn't find the one that I was using before, but then I found this one, so yeah, I just really love it. It's a really good highlighter. It gives you a really nice sheen. It doesn't have any shimmer to it. I'm actually wearing it today. Really good stuff. And then I have my Revlon Color Burst Lacquer Balm in the shade Coquette, which I also had in my favorites video, so I'm not going to talk much about that, but um, this is the only lip product I have in here right now because it's the one I've been wearing the most, um, so it just goes with, it, with whatever look I'm going for for the day, so that's always a safe bet. And then I have my MAC Paint Pot and Groundwork, which is my newest addition as far as cream eyeshadows are concerned. It's just a great neutral everyday color. And I've been wearing that on a consistent basis lately. And then the last thing in this pocket is my CoverGirl Look Line Blast Eyeliner, which I've started to wear again. I really, really like. Um, actually, one of my favorite eyeliners ever. So that whole pocket just happened to be um, all eye stuff. And on this side, I have face stuff. Um, sometimes, some days it's organized like that, some days it's not. It just kind of depends on the day. But in here I have my Wet n Wild Blush and Mellow Wine, which is honestly one of the most pigmented blushes I own. It's really great wearing it today. This is also something I'm trying to um, use more of, just kind of work back into my routine. Gives you a really nice natural flush. So there's that. And then I have my Revlon Nearly Naked Powder, 
which I really really like as you guys saw in my favorites video as well so I'm wearing that today and then I'm trying out this new um, concealer for the first time today it's the covergirl clean invisible concealer it looks like this um, and it's in the shade Tawny, and I mean, as far as first impressions go, I really like it, and it's really good, like, full coverage concealer for the face, so, so far, so good. I'm going to have my Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. This is the color correcting adjust version. So I'm liking that so far, and then I've got my NYX Cream Blush in Natural to pair with Mellow Wine, which is really good. It just kind of goes with it nicely, because... This color is very bold, um, and if, I mean, I want a natural flush, but not like super, like, intense kind of blush look, kind of in between. Um, those two are good to mix together, so there's that. Then I have my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer, which I've been wearing pretty much every day under my eyes, and I'm liking so far. And then, of course, my Revlon Nearly Naked Foundation, which is my absolute favorite at the moment. Um, and I've actually just repurchased another bottle, so yeah, that is my current beauty carousel. Um, let me get let I would say that let me know what you guys um whether or not you'd like to see this or that basically. Um, if so, I will do it maybe once a week, once every two weeks, something like that. Um, so yeah, that is it. I hope you guys are having a good one, and I will see you soon. Bye.